Well, Merry Christmas. I just wanted to come on this day and just wish you a Merry Christmas. And I also wanted to just pray along with you today in person. The channel is Let Us Pray Every Day, so certainly today is like none other in that we will pray. But I wanted to just come on and just show my space. Usually you just hear my voice, but today I wanted to show my face and allow you to pray along with me. This is the day the Lord has made and we are choosing to rejoice and be glad in it. We're grateful today that we're celebrating the birth of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Well, there's so much going on in the world, but Jesus is the reason for the season. And we know that without him, our relationship with Father God would not even be possible. So we choose to celebrate his birth today. But I want to uh, pray along with you uh, as as we gather together. So would you bow your head with me? Father God, we're thankful today for the many blessings that you've bestowed upon us. But today we're celebrating the birth of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. We thank you, Father God, for sending him to this earth so that we could uh, receive him as our Lord and Savior. We thank you, Jesus, for the price that you paid for us, that we could be back in right relationship with our Father. Holy Spirit, we're rejoicing today for you because you're the one who raised him from that grave. And now he's seated at the right hand of the Father, and yet he's still interceding for us. So thank you, Lord Jesus. We thank you for coming to this earth and living a perfect life and paying the price for us. And we give you praise and we celebrate you today. So we say happy birthday to you, Lord Jesus. And now, right now, Father God, I want to pray for those who are viewing today. A special prayer for them. There may be some today who may have had a loved one to depart. And during this time, this might be your first Christmas without your loved one. And I want to pray for you. So, Father God, we lift them up before you today. And we thank you, Lord, that your word says that you would never leave us nor forsake us. So we know that you are always with us. So I lift up the people before you today who are, have their loved ones to depart or transition out of this life. And today is their first day of celebrating Christmas without their loved one. So I pray, Lord God, that you would give them your peace. Your peace for them right now. That peace that surpasses all understanding. And I pray that they receive your peace. Lord God, I pray that you would give them the God, that they will put on the garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness. So I come against the spirit of heaviness over you right now in the name of Jesus. And I release the peace of God to flow in you, to flow. The Bible says that if you would keep your mind stayed on God, that he would give you perfect peace. So Father, I pray that they will keep their mind stayed on you today. That they will not be weary, Father God. I come against the spirit of weariness. I come against that spirit of depression over you in the name of Jesus. That the peace of God, the peace of God will surround your mind and your heart. Thank you, Father God, for your peace. We thank you that you are Jehovah Shalom. You are the God of peace. So receive the peace of God right now. I pray, Father God, that they will have great memories, that they will remember their loved ones and how they've celebrated with them in times past, Father God. So we just thank you that they have great memories of their loved one, Father. We thank you, Lord God, for you are faithful. We thank you, Lord God, that you'll be with them today and you'll be with them for the days to come, Father. You'll be with them as the new year rolls around. So we thank you, Lord God. We thank you, Father God. We give you praise today for your faithfulness. Thank you for your peace. We thank you for your joy, that your joy is strengthening them even right now, that they are able to make it through this day. Thank you, Father. We know that Jesus is the reason for this season, Father God. So we just thank you for it, Lord, and we give you praise for all that you're doing right now. In the mighty name of Jesus, amen, amen. Well, hallelujah. And thank God for you today and thank you for tuning in. I pray that you would receive that prayer, that you would receive the peace of God and you would receive his joy today. And remember, he's always with you and he loves you. And I love you too. Have a Merry Christmas and we'll see you again soon. Thanks for joining in.